fruitcake. Whether it's the dessert or the name that guy called you in high school, nobody really likes it. Until today. It's day three of Shake Miss, and today we are making a fruitcake inspired milkshake. I have never had fruitcake in my entire life, so today is going to be the closest I've ever gotten to having fruitcake. I looked up a recipe online, and we're going to put as much as we can of the ingredients into the milkshake and blend it up, and hopefully it's not that bad. For this milkshake, you're going to need a lot of different ingredients. You're going to need vanilla ice cream, some eggnog, vanilla extract, cinnamon, nutmeg, cloves, some chopped up nuts, I'm going with pecans myself, and then some dried fruit. I have some different types of cherries and stuff that you would put into a fruit cake. Start off with a few scoops of vanilla ice cream. Put in all of the spices. We've got nutmeg, cloves, and cinnamon. Some chopped nuts. Like I said, I'm going with pecans myself. Some of the fruit for the fruit cake. Hopefully these things chop up in the blender. We've got some green ones too. That just does not look natural for a cherry. But it's gonna be festive, green and red. I'm gonna go ahead and try one of these. Doesn't tastes like a cherry. It was kind of dry and crunchy. Interesting. Put in a little vanilla extract and some eggnog. Blend it up. Pour it into the glass. Look at all the colors in there. It may not taste good, but it's definitely the most festive. And maybe enjoy. This is my first time, the closest thing I've ever had to fruitcake. I don't know what, it, it's very pecan-y. I think I might've put too many pecans in there. And the fruit, I don't know. If you love fruit cake, you may love this. Me, I'm not so sure. But as I said, it is the most festive looking. So what do you guys think? Are you a fan of fruit cake or not? In the comment section down below, let me know if you love fruit cake. What's your favorite kind? Is there different kinds? I don't know. Or do you hate it and do you dread this time of year? Be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the Shake Miss videos. We've got 12 of them coming. This was only the third one, so we've got nine more. Check out yesterday's video where me and my brother and our friend Ethan created a new Christmas ghost story that you can tell your family on Christmas Eve Eve. There'll be a thumbnail at the end of this video and a link in the description for that. Remember, there's always a reason to celebrate.